Um, I just want to let you know your applications are approved. Yes, yes, absolutely. I'm happy too. So check your email. I'm going to let you know what the next steps are, okay? All right, take care. Bye. Hi, I love telling people they're approved, and I love it when they get the apartment they want. Hi there, my name is Ethan. You may have seen me at your community's rental office. I wanted to go over a quick announcement about renter's insurance and what happens when we get notices of cancellations from insurance company. Like for example, right now I have a stack of them. Do your state farms, your USAAs, your progressives. You know, they send us letters that say, um, hey attention, this person's policy has been canceled for non-payment. So that means that uh, apartment does not have any insurance anymore. Well, the good thing is that our liability insurance would apply to your apartment once we get that notice. That's a $10 charge that you'd see on your account right away. And then we're gonna email you or send you a letter that says that you should have already gotten a notice from your insurance company as well, if we did. It would say something along these lines. Notice of cancellation, usually for non-payment or something, but sometimes people are just like, yeah, I don't want it. Um, but we would get a copy of that as an interested party on the policy. So when we get that, boom, immediately $10 is applied for your apartment. And I want to explain that so people uh, understand. Yes, the $10 per month will automatically begin charging uh, as soon as we get those. However, your own insurance company is the only one that would pay for like your belongings. That $10 per month basic uh, property liability is uh, required to cover the property in the event of damage, not the resident's personal property. That's something you get on the phone with, with um, you know, whoever your insurance company is. A lot of people use the same one for their um, uh, car insurance and renters. And they, that's when you go through the list of what you're actually covering. Covering my computer, covering my um, nice clothing, my shoes. The guy has a lot of shoes he covers. Um, let's see, uh, electronics, my furniture, some great couch. You know, if that gets damaged um, and all you have is the basic minimal liability, it's not going to cover that nice couch. Some people choose to go with that. It's up to you. I just want to take a minute and explain that to you. And we're going to, we go through these periodically. Um, but whenever they send us these cancellation notices, that's what uh, it means. All right, if you have any questions, get on the phone with me. I'll be happy to go over it with you and uh, take care of any issues. All right, thanks so much. Have a great day.